Yo, what's up guys? My name is JT and this is of course Model Railroad in the Southwest. So as you can see, a lot of the stuff is missing from the layout, including the travel center, the vehicles and all the figures. So those are all packed up and ready for storage because the layout is coming down. So this is gonna be the last video of this layout for a very long time. Just kidding. I'm actually take I took everything off so I can go ahead and clean everything because it is full of plaster, dust, dirt, and everything from working on the other scenes. So I took everything off, I vacuumed it all up, and it's ready to go. So let me show you guys what I've done. So over here, I've worked on the rock face, and I painted it up, and it looks pretty decent. As you can see, there's a white area right there. Um, it really didn't take paint well, and I'm not sure why. I don't know what's there. It should just be plaster, but it doesn't look so bad in person, so I might just leave it or I might try to use some other kind of paint, maybe some oil-based paint or something. But over here, I put this little bit of a ramp here. It's made out of gravel, and that's just to display semi-trucks for the dealership to show what they have to offer. So on the rest of it, I put sand and gravel and all that to make it look a little more realistic. It may seem a little dark on the camera. It's not so dark in person it is a little darker than the rest of the layout and i think it's because i put a little too much mod podge and it kind of just darkened up a bit but it looks okay in real life over here i put some gravel for some drainage areas for the parking lots and i was going to put in some piping to to simulate drainage pipes but i feel like it's just it, it'll be okay i think it'll, it'll look okay without the drainage pipes so what I'm going to go ahead is install some Xeroscape, which is pretty much <laughs> what this is. And I'm going to install that in front of the parking lots and areas around the buildings. So I've installed sand and dirt along the highway. So that's pretty much ready to go. And I'm going to install the shrubs and uh, some of the weeds and stuff that I've applied. I'm also going to install, install some little details and stuff, so I'll be back when I got all the shrubs and weeds in, and we'll see what that looks like. Alrighty, so it's been a few weeks since the last part of the video. I got a little busy, but here it is. Here is the scenery, and it's pretty much done. I have a few little things I got to get done to it. Just a few more things to make it look a little more realistic. But I think it came out pretty decent. And uh, I like those gravel uh, drainage ditches. I think they look pretty neat there. I put a few branches or a few bushes behind the UPS store. And then there's the UPS truck with a dolly next to it. On the back, I put some barrels and some tires. Those tires came off of a pickup truck, but... They're a little deep, so I think they kind of represent the dualies from a semi-truck, so I left them there. There's a guy rolling out a tire. And inside the dealership, I put a, uh, a tractor in there, in the showroom. And then I put the semi-truck right here. This is where the truck ramp's supposed to be, but I don't know if I'm going to build it anymore. Because I really like the way this truck looks right here. It's a nice eye catcher for people coming down the road and they see it with the hood open. I think it looks pretty neat. I got some more vehicles. I'll give you guys a quick look. I got this F, uh, F350. Could be an F450. I don't know what it is. And then I got this Ram 2500, the black one. And I don't know if you guys have seen this, but I got this Hummer with the trailer. It's got some stuff on the top on the on the rack. And I got also got this uh, Ford Torino. All right, so let's go see the other side real quick. So here's the other side of the layout, and you can see the truck a little bit better right there. And I put a box truck and, like I said, the tractor inside the showroom. There's a couple of guys making a deal. Probably buying a 50 
international trucks or something also got this tow truck right here i know it's not rated for semi trucks but i don't know i think kind of looks pretty neat there there's a guy carrying a spool of wire the guy taking out the trash the guy working on that semi truck right there there's the back of the ups store So also I wanted to mention the road signs that I got. There's some stop signs and some speed limit signs and do not pass and stuff going down the road as you can see there. I got those off of eBay. Another truck I got was this Ram with the push guard and the roll bar with some lights on top. But overall I think this looks really good guys. I really am happy with the way it came out. I just need a few little things like I said that I need to finish, but I'm pretty happy with it. So that's pretty much it guys. Thanks for watching. If you guys have any comments or questions, put them in a comment below. So like I said, that's pretty much it. Talk to you later. Take care and keep it between the rails.